Today we're going to be taking a look at the Optronics One LED RV taillight. This is for the driver's side of your RV. The rectangular RV taillight is going to serve four functions such as your stop light, tail light, turn signal light, and on the bottom we have the license plate light. The One Series is going to provide bright light using fewer diodes when compared to other LED lights. Um, it's going to feature durable surface mount technology when it comes to the construction of the LED circuit board. That's going to better withstand shock and vibration and it's going to allow for improved heat distribution. Now LEDs are going to make great replacements for incandescent lights. They actually last much longer. Uh, they're much more efficient and they're going to burn brighter. You don't have to worry about replacing bulbs and you don't have to worry about brittle filaments. This unit is going to feature a black ABS plastic base with a nice red acrylic lens. The lens can be easily removed and replaced if needed. Uh, but you will have to remove it anyways to gain access to the mounting holes. There's going to be one located on each corner. To do that, I find it easiest to use a flat head screwdriver, place it into this area here, and simply just separate the lens from the housing. Very easy to do so. And then when you're ready to replace it, the clear lens for the license plate has a little groove that it slides into. So make sure that that is set, and then you can simply just snap this back into place here on the housing. On the bottom for the license plate, it's going to have the nice clear lens. It really allows a lot of light to come through. Um, and then it's going to have the license plate mounting bracket built into the housing as well. This is designed to be a surface mount installation. Your hardware is not included. It's going to contain a three-wire design, so white's going to be for ground, black's going to be for your taillights, green's going to be for the stop and turn signal light. It is Department of Transportation compliant, so it meets FMVSS and CMVSS 108 requirements for automotive lighting. Again, it is for the driver's side. Um, the overall length of the light, that's going to give us a measurement of 8 and 5 eighths of an inch long. The height of just the light area. 3 and 3 sixteenths, if we include the brackets for the license plate mount, we're looking at an overall height of about 5 inches. Uh, the holes between, or the amount of distance we have between the holes for the license plate mount, that's going to be 7 inches. Um, and then the overall depth, front to back, is going to be about 2 and 1 quarter of an inch. The mount hole separation, when it comes to mounting, going this direction, we're looking at 1 and 7 eighths of an inch. And then go in this direction, center on center, we're looking at 7 and 3 eighths of an inch. The power draw is at 12.8 volts for the stop light, it's 0.34 amps. For the turn signal light, it's 0.01 amps. And for the tail light, it's 0.094 amps. Optronics is also going to put a lifetime warranty on the LEDs. We're going to go and hook it up to our external power source, that way you can see what it looks like with power running to it. We'll also be able to turn off our overhead lights so you can see it in a low light setting. Got to make sure that our wires aren't crossing. That does interfere when it comes to the power and ground. There we go. So you can see here the light is going to send out a nice consistent signal output. Uh, you have the white light on the bottom for the license plate light, and then you have the main light there in the center for the running light or tail lights. When we apply our brakes, you can see how that increases the light output for a strong consistent signal and it's going to do that when we activate our turn signal. That's going to do it for today's look at the Optronics One LED RV tail light.